I really like Italian food, and I was really quite surprised. I actually never heard of this recipe called Assassina Pasta, which means killer pasta, which is a really weird name for a dish. But it's a very interesting dish, and I decided to try making it myself for the first time ever. And basically, you cook it like risotto. And if you never cooked risotto before, it's a really slow process of adding、um, stock to、uh, a grain, and then you cook it until it's fully cooked. So the whole process is basically cooking it like risotto, except you're using pasta sauce, and instead of like you know. A thick pasta sauce, you thin it out so it's watery, and you cook it till it's dry. Otherwise, you know it'll burn too fast. And it's it's really interesting.、Um, another way that people also do it is to use pasta sauce and then use hot water also, so that way you can control the thickness and you can get more caramelization of the pasta and the sauce itself. I think honestly that probably is the better way to do it instead of thinning out the pasta sauce. And what I did learn about this recipe is one, I do not have a pan that's big enough to actually do using spaghetti. And I saw another recipe where they use、uh, smaller pastas. I forgot their name, like elbows and things like that,、uh, to cook it. And I think honestly, I'm going to try this recipe again, but I'm going to try it that way instead. And I think I honestly could have done a lot better because over time, as I was stirring the pasta. A lot of it broke, and as you can see, it's quite broken and short now. Sorry, Italians. Well, if you like this recipe, come back and、uh, follow, like, and subscribe, and hope you、uh, follow us and come back next week for another episode. Enjoy.